everyone. I'm so happy to see you here. Are you ready to make some flowers with me? Let's put some uh, party streamers to work and make a nice wall decor. Keep this project completely on a budget. I decided to use the piece of the cardboard and all what I like to do is just make a nice background and I'm going just simply paint it with my chalk paint. You can also use the uh, paintster sticks, you just have to glue them together or use any um, uh, wooden boards just to make the project look a little bit different. I just wiped it off a bit to um, have it more of an antique feel to it and now let's keep folding our uh, crepe paper streamers. These are the ones of course you know you're using uh, just to have fun to decorate at the parties but this time what I like to do is just simply fold them in few layers and then of course divide them into thirds and then start to form a flower out of them. follow me for some time you do know that I love my flowers full so that's why the more layers you have the better the flower is going to look so now we are getting ready to cut each folded piece of the streamers we were just folding in into thirds so um, see and this is what I'm going to try to form and I will fold this again in a half and create a little petals just like that and of course a little bit of the hot glue right in the top and a little bit right on the loop um, and you are all done. You don't really have to glue the entire uh, crepe paper to our board. As you can see is that is just enough to glue in two places the hot glue in two places our crepe paper of course as you keep folding it some of those loose pieces are just become um, uh, not really good looking so as you notice I was just nicely trimming them of course and now look at this I am going to try to make the full uh, flower but then of course as you can see is I do have a lot of other colors and I do want to bring all of them into my bouquet so I am not going to make them full I'm going to try to make them partially And just like that, um, the flowers are sort of done, but we cannot forget about the, uh, the center of it. So I just simply installed the wooden bead right in there. But as I am installing them, I just simply figure out that I would like to have some kind of a base for them to know how do I go around making another flowers. So I decided to cut additional um, cardboard pieces that I had on the side to create some kind of a planter. that some of my projects just simply evolved as I am making them so this is a good example of that and of course I created a little flap I'm going to add the hot glue attach it to my um, cardboard and then hopefully I will be able to paint this and that's going to be my base was actually very lucky and I did not mess up my white background so now it's time to cut even more of those uh, strips and create even more of the flowers and start to see the project being completed I am adding the flowers 
flowers in a random position. Some of them are full, some of them are halfway um, open. That's how I see them in the nature. They are not every single one of them uh, perfect. And as you notice, I'm adding a little weed. You can also add the little button. Just anything that brings more interest. I just got to a point is when I do wanted to actually try and overlap some flowers on the top of each other and now look at this it actually does work and of course all what I need right now is to hot glue my little uh, window box and I'll be all good you got to make sure to hold that for a little bit see what happens it just opens up so now it's time to um, to work on the most important things the little details so I decided to bring obviously a little bit of my Spanish moss right to my box that I mixed with the green ra reindeer moss uh, my favorite and of course I'm going to bring some leaves or maybe I'm going to even try to use the crepe paper but I am not really positive about that I think I'm going to leave it for now. It just, the color just doesn't go with whatever I'm creating. So I am going to outline it with a little bit of my rope to have a nice finishing edges. And I think I will be ready to start to make the pictures. Looking at it, I do actually like what I see, but I think a little bit of the leaves, a little bit of the greenery that I always have in handy from my garlands, I think it will be a great idea to add, but now the problem is, where do I add it? I think this is the best placement, just a little bit on the sides. Of course, I gotta have three little branches. I think I am content with what I'm looking at right now. I think that's what I'm going to leave it at. So um, I hope you enjoyed that quick uh, project with the cardboard box and I hope I inspired you to make one for yourself out of the uh, party streamers. Again, thanks for watching and I hope to see you soon. Bye.